So when people tell me you have to move closer to Patrick's specialist or, you know, move to five minutes from the hospital, that's not reality. The reality of the situation is having a special needs child already puts a financial burden on families, period. Because you have so many more specialists that you have to take, go to monthly. Right now, we're a one-income household. Why? Because I have to be home with my son. I have to be home with my three-year-old daughter. I am the one that does it all because someone has to work. And unfortunately, what that looks like is you living on a one-income household because one parent has to be there. It should not be hard to be a stay-at-home parent of a special needs child. The GFPD provides me with a family that gets it, that just totally understands what I go through on a day-to-day -day basis. I love that they offer the resources that they do. Conferences are our favorite. They're bringing our families together and putting us in front of the correct scientists and the correct people. We have more families coming in and more kids like ours, and we get to love them all. I don't want any other family to go through what we have. I don't want any other family to have to watch their child regress. I know that the research and the cure that we're looking for probably won't come in Patrick's lifetime. But if it helps the next baby, I'm okay with that.